Welcome guys back to Fire Creeper 123. Today we're playing Gems of War. This is like my first video ever hosting a uh, Gems of War video theme of all So, um, if you're watching this right now, you know that this is the first time I'm playing this game. Well, no. This is the first video I'm making of playing this game. And I just wanted to show you some aspects of it. So basically, it's a game where you collect cards, sort of like Pokemon, but you have to match like three in a row gems to power up those cards and they do attacks that attack the other players. Ooh, guild task, 25 diamonds. Okay. Uh, guilds are pretty cool. You know, let's take, okay, yeah, it's loading. Okay, so basically you do tasks and you get stuff for like the whole team. And my, uh, my guild team is called Spirit of Gems, if you want to join my own guild, if you play. Spirit of Gems, 100 gems for 750,000 gold. So if I donated, like, my 3,000 gold, someone donated 200,000, and other people donated it, it builds up, and then everyone in the guild gets it. Uh, troops, these are just all the cards I have. And this is my team. This is m myself. And Dagger of the Void. And then this is Yeo Gua. I pronounce him. He just 12 damage to the first two enemies. Let's go. Uh, Blind Guardian, he drains mana. And I like him. And then this guy, he gives everyone shield. Yeah. And uh, I have gems. So whenever there's like offers. Ooh. Ooh. See. Okay. Crafty. Oh my gosh. So basically, yeah. And these other aspects, I wanna do a battle for you guys. So I'm, so basically you have to go on this quest and you fight people. Okay, I'm gonna fight a ghoul. But the thing is, so every team has four cards. And my team is on the left and the other people are on the right. And anytime you get a four in a row, like there's four blue right here, you get an extra turn. Mana surge. Mana surge. Oh, wow. Ma mana surges are basically, you get more mana. So you see on the left, like, Yeo Gua has 6 out of 15 mana. So that means if I get... 9 more mana for him, that he'll do it. Skulls mean automatic attack. You see my top person has 14 attack, so he does 14 damage. So he's going to use his turn to do skulls. Doing 5 damage to me. Haha. -ha. That's like nothing. And then I can do some green. Oh no. Let's do some purples. I have a banner for it, which makes me get more purples. There. Now I can drain people's mana if they get too high. Now what I'm gonna start doing is I'm gonna start getting green. So I can get Yale Gua. Since he's like the my main offensive character. Oh, you see on the right side, this guy has eight out of ten mana. But if I use Unseen Eye, he drains it all. And the Unseen Eye explodes gem equal to the mana drain. So he basically explodes eight gems. And that would be a lot of stuff. Like, and then all the mana flows to my characters. So I could get him back up. Oh, so Yeo Gua is up. So he does 12 damage to the first two enemies based off my life. And so he has, since he has 32 life, that's plus 10. So 22 damage to the first two enemies. And he steals magic which is very important, so he does more damage the next turn. And then he transforms all purple's gems to red. Yeah, I like him. Definitely. And plus five, these are called Doom Skulls. Basically, when you match them, it does plus five damage, so 19, but that guy only has 16 health, so I killed him. And then Dagger of the Void. Okay. Now I need to kill that last person. Imagine I... Okay, yeah, there we go! So yeah, so I get victory, I get all these rewards. Okay. So... I get all this stuff. Oh, look, I'm level 56. Nothing. Um, nine, but the, all, all my things are nine. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna do purple. Deal seven damage to all enemies. Hmm. He 
let me go look at this. That hoe. Hmm. Oh, here, it takes purple. I can't do that. Hmm. I can only take stuff that takes blue. Well, those are, that's that. Up here is my badges, so I can like, do that. And it gives me bonuses, like life and armor, 12 troops. And yeah. And you unlock kingdoms, like by doing more battles. See, yeah, it's at eight out of 25. That's good. Ooh, I can do this for 50 souls. Oh yeah, you use souls to upgrade your characters. So, back in my troops, I would have someone that would have, like, 5 shield and 3 life. But if you upgrade them, you can see, like, my troops have, like, 23 shield and 30 life. Uh, 4 green. I, oh, yeah, and for, I have an Oracle champion level up. And that means that every time I get a 4 or 5 gem match, I get 2 life. So, it's helpful. Because my Yeogua like does damage based off his, off his life, surge. which is really good. So I'm just awesome. Mana surge. There we go. So now, whenever someone gets too high of mana, I drain it, and then they can't do anything about it. And then, yay! What can I do? Is that the only thing I can do? Mana surge. Yay! Okay. Oh yes, let's go. Let's go. Seven out of ten is still not enough. Uh oh yes, red. I can get more your guy up. Okay, I guess I'll just do brown. Can I even do brown? No, I need to do purple again. Wait, actually I'll just drain this person's mana. See, look, now it's almost like a whole new board. Do, do, do. You could do yellow. Sure. Hmm. Ah, uh, yeah. And now the game's over. Look at the sky is too OP. Ah! So, uh, subscribe and smash the like button if you like this video, because I'm probably going to be making more. If we get two likes. Like, two is like a lot. Like, one plus one, two. You know. So, yeah. Um, Fire Creeper 123, out.